The astonishing discovery near Proxima Centauri, expanded, what if the first undeniable evidence of life beyond Earth didn't come from some distant corner of the cosmos, not from a galaxy millions of light years away that we may never reach but instead, from our own cosmic backyard, just over four light years away? Imagine this. A rocky, Earth-sized planet orbiting Proxima Centauri, the closest known star to our Sun. This planet, known as Proxima Centauri b, may hold the key to unlocking one of the most profound and ancient questions humanity has ever asked. Are we truly alone in the universe? Recently, something extraordinary unfolded in the realm of space exploration. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, our most advanced and powerful observatory yet made a discovery that has left scientists and astronomers stunned. As it gazed deep into the cosmos, peering across over 7 trillion miles of space, it observed something unexpected something utterly astonishing. JWST captured strange flickering lights on the night side of Proxima Centauri b. These weren't just natural glimmers or reflections from the star. They were rhythmic, patterned, and structured in a way that was eerily similar to city lights seen from space here on Earth. This revelation has ignited a firestorm of curiosity, debate, and cautious excitement across the global scientific community. Because if these lights are artificial, they may be the first indirect evidence of intelligent life beyond Earth. Could it really be possible that a technological civilization perhaps even one older and more advanced than ours exists just a few light years away? A planet full of potential and peril Proxima Centauri b has long intrigued astronomers and planetary scientists. It's located in what is known as the habitable zone of its host star. This is the narrow region around a star where conditions might allow liquid water to exist on the planet's surface a key ingredient for sustaining life as we know it. But the planet is far from a safe haven. Unlike Earth, Proxima Centauri b orbits incredibly close to its star just 4.66 million miles away. To put that into perspective, Earth orbits the Sun from a distance of about 93 million miles. This extreme proximity means the planet is constantly bombarded by intense stellar radiation and frequent solar flares, which could strip away or severely damage any atmosphere the planet might possess. Despite these hostile conditions, Proxima Centauri b remains one of our best hopes for discovering alien life. Why? Because even in extreme environments, life finds a way at least on Earth. On our own planet, microorganisms thrive in boiling acid pools, under miles of ice, and near volcanic vents on the ocean floor. Now imagine a world where intelligent beings evolved in a similarly harsh environment. Imagine they developed advanced technology not just to survive, but to thrive, adapting to conditions far more extreme than anything we've endured on Earth. A signal we cannot ignore the lights observed by JWST on the night side of Proxima Centauri b appear organized and persistent. They don't behave like natural atmospheric phenomena or volcanic glow. Instead, they mirror the kind of illumination patterns that come from energy use on a massive scale like power grids lighting up cities on Earth as the sun goes down. This has led some scientists to ask, could this be evidence of an advanced alien civilization using artificial lighting? The possibility is staggering. If life on Proxima Centauri b exists, and if it has developed the means to harness energy and light its world during the dark hours, then this may be the first true glimpse we've ever had of extraterrestrial intelligence not in the form of radio signals, but through the silent glow of distant lights. Whatever these flickers may be, they represent a mystery that demands attention. Because in the darkness of space, the search for life deepens, expanded. While this breathtaking discovery has sparked a wave of excitement across the globe, it has also introduced a host of questions many of which remain unanswered. One thing is clear. The role of the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is now more important than ever in the pursuit of cosmic truth. It is no longer just a telescope it has become humanity's window into the unknown. With its state-of-the-art infrared imaging technology, the JWST is uniquely capable of detecting faint sources of heat and light that ordinary telescopes cannot see. Unlike visible light observatories, JWST can peer through dust, darkness, 
and distance to reveal thermal patterns that may hint at artificial processes, possibly even signs of advanced civilizations manipulating energy on planetary scales. The lights observed on Proxima Centauri b's night side are especially intriguing because of how structured they appear. Natural phenomena tend to be scattered, chaotic, and unpredictable. But these lights exhibit consistent patterns and intensities traits often associated with technological sources, such as energy grids, powered structures, or advanced settlements. If the light signatures are stable over time and recur across multiple orbits, it might indicate some kind of controlled illumination system, a feature that mirrors how Earth's cities glow with artificial lighting during the night. Reading the atmosphere of another world, but the JWST isn't just about images. It's also a powerful tool for atmospheric analysis something crucial in determining a planet's habitability or even its potential for life. As Proxima Centauri b passes in front of or behind its star, some of the starlight filters through its atmosphere. The JWST can capture and analyze this filtered light to identify specific chemical signatures a process known as transit spectroscopy. By examining how the light is altered, Scientists can determine which gases are present in the planet's atmosphere. This is a game-changing ability. If JWST detects gases such as oxygen, carbon dioxide, methane, or water vapor, it could provide the first solid biochemical evidence that life possibly even intelligent life exists beyond Earth. Even more intriguingly, the proportions and combinations of these gases could hint at industrial processes or even deliberate atmospheric manipulation clues that might point to a technologically advanced civilization. Alien technology or unknown natural forces? Of course, not everyone is ready to accept the idea that we've found alien life. Science demands rigorous evidence, skepticism, and the elimination of alternative explanations before reaching extraordinary conclusions there could be natural causes for the observed lights. They might result from geological activity, such as volcanic lava flows, glowing mineral surfaces, or even planet-wide auroras induced by magnetic storms from Proxima Centauri. Still, the regularity and intensity of the light signals are hard to dismiss as purely natural. Many scientists believe the patterns are too distinct and too persistent to be explained by random natural processes. Dr. David Kipping, an astrophysicist at Columbia University, has pointed out that Proxima Centauri b displays unusual thermal behavior compared to other exoplanets. Rather than acting like a passive rock heated by starlight, the planet seems to emit energy in strange ways suggesting some form of thermal regulation or energy redistribution that doesn't fit with known planetary models. If these anomalies are caused by an artificial infrastructure such as underground cities, energy harvesting systems, or climate controlling technologies it would represent a level of technological advancement far beyond anything we have achieved on Earth. A new era in the search for life, regardless of what the lights truly are, one thing is certain. The discovery has marked a turning point in humanity's search for extraterrestrial life. The James Webb Space Telescope has already revolutionized our understanding of the universe. And with every new observation, it takes us a step closer to solving one of the greatest mysteries of all time. But JWST is only the beginning. In the coming years, powerful next-generation observatories like the Extremely Large Telescope, ELT, scheduled to begin operations in 2028 will be able to probe even deeper. With far more sensitive instruments and adaptive optics, the ELT will allow scientists to analyze exoplanet atmospheres with unprecedented clarity and detail. This means we'll soon be able to confirm or challenge the findings made by JWST, and perhaps finally answer whether those city-like lights on Proxima Centauri b are a sign of life or just a cosmic illusion. The cosmic question endures for now, we watch and wait. We listen to the signals, study the data, and hold our breath as the universe slowly reveals its secrets. Because every light in the sky is a story waiting to be told. And maybe just maybe the next chapter of that story involves someone else watching the stars from their own world. Looking back at us. Are we alone? Or are we just beginning to discover that the universe has always been more alive than we